Hello, buenos dias, buenas, 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 buenas. Hello. Good Hola. morning. Hey. Good afternoon. Good evening. You all right? <laughs> right. Been to the market. You saw that video yesterday. But we've come back from the market. We've edited it. We're just about to go out for lunch. We're off for a McDonald's, believe it or not. Yay. Looking we, forward to it. Yeah, I am. Just getting a load of McDonald's and yeah. bringing it back here and then eating what we want throughout the day. Yeah. But I'm feeling bad, Mazzy. Editing the video, you was watching that clip. You were tempted to buy a particular top, weren't you? Well, you know, I've got my, my Ray-Ban sunglasses, which I need to go into. That's a different story. Yeah. My lime green <laughs> Ray-Ban sunglasses. I've got my new cap. Espana. Yep. I did see something else I wanted to buy over there. And yeah. I didn't because it was a round neck, not a V neck, and it put me off. But I think I'm going to go back and get it. See, I thought originally you didn't want it because it was V neck. Personally, I prefer the round neck, darling. So if you're going to go back and get it, it's perfect. I need perfect. another look. I need another yeah. look. I can't even remember the price. It's a fake Hugo Boss jumper, basically. No, it's not a fake Hugo Boss. It no, is, it's a Hugo it Boss a jumper. Hugo Boss. <laughs> Hugo um, Boss wore it himself back in 19... Whenever. It's going to be 25, 30 euro. No, no more than for 25. It was either 15 or 25. Was it? I've got a feeling it was 15. I've got a feeling it was 25. But I don't know, I went on the stall. I just like the colour because it was bright red. And I'm going for bright on this holiday. Yeah. So I'm going to go get that. You finish watching the video we made from yes. yesterday. And I'll be back. You're going to come back, yeah? yeah and then right. we go off to McDonald's. And then we're off to McDonald's. Yes, our first proper takeaway in Spain. Yes, 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 yes. Hey, you got your wallet. Got your new wallet or your old wallet? The old one. Look at him. Look, look at cobwebs falling out of that. <laughs> <laughs> so I've been home about an hour. I'm going to say guess about an hour. And in the end, I had to actually put boiling water into this from the kettle <laughs> because I established the hotter the water, the more steam you're going to get. Now, although we're getting steam out of it, it's not looking like it was on the on the actual stall. I don't know whether we've got a dodgy one here or whether it's not as good as like he was selling. Anyway, I'm in the process of editing and I'm just gonna wait for Dan. We have both decided though, we're gonna, when we get to McDonald's, we're gonna order everything and anything. We're both starving. Uh, we didn't have a lot to eat yesterday. A sausage sandwich, first thing in the morning. And then that was it. We didn't really have much else for the rest of the day. So we're gonna order loads. What? You're all, home already? It's all packed up. Really? It's six minutes past two. So it must be like 10 o'clock in the morning till two. Oh no. You're going to feel gutted now, aren't you? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, don't cry, don't cry. <laughs> it's not often I'm going to get some money out of my wallet and pay for something. But I was willing to. Well, if, if you go back for something the second time, then I know you want it. Oh, dear. Well, it is what it is then, isn't it? Never mind. Never mind. Still got this. Yeah. Come on. All right, I'll, I'll move into this. Just wait there. Where is he going? You know, I was talking about the Ray-Ban sunglasses I got. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the Ray-Bans, yeah? Yeah just realized after having them for like nearly two days they're not ray-ban they're not even fake ray-ban they're Ray -Ban. supposed to be ray-bans they're supposed to be ray-bans well they're not they're actually well, of they are jolly rules it says on it no but the whole point is they're supposed to be fake ray-bans it's with got the writing the, it's got the ray-ban yeah. look about it with the same the font of writing yes yeah. it's but like not. jolly rules it's like going to Aldi and getting your form flakes <laughs> or going to Tesco's and getting your feet bix <laughs> Feet bix I don't know. Never yeah. mind, never mind. Never mind. Oh, you can't even say you've got Ray-Bans anymore now then. Yeah, but I have got Jolly Roses. Well, enjoy them. Right, okay, so we're just leaving campsite. Wow. Uh -huh. 
the entire market is actually packed up. It's mad. It's mad. It's all good. Yeah, all packing up. Hugo Boss is gone. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I'm guided for you because I know how it feels. I wanted that cardigan from the first campsite place. Never mind. Well, I'm not bothered. I'm not that bothered because it wasn't exactly what I wanted anyway. No, but you went back the second time, so it meant you wanted it. Yeah. Well, yeah, no more. I'd rather have a McDonald's. Yeah, we're going to get everything and anything, aren't we? Everything. Everything. Because we've got a fridge. You know, we can buy things, we can keep it cool. We've got another day here tomorrow. We can just get stuff and keep reheating it all through the night. Wake up at three in the morning, get up, <laughs> throw a burger in the microwave, sorted. Well, all we had yesterday was a sausage sandwich each, really, wasn't it? Yeah. And in the morning, that was. We were starving last night. <laughs> the Golden Arches, McDonald's, 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 Kentucky Fried Chicken and a Pizza Hut. We have actually got Kentucky Fried, Chicken. Kentucky got fried Chicken here as well. No Pizza Hut. It looks just like England ones, Margaret. It, oh, I'll tell you what, I'm, I don't care as long as it tastes good. How do I get in? I don't know. This is dry food, darling. Where, Mazza? Where? Okay, so what are we going to order? How do you do it? It's, it's all in the Spaniard. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Press something. Sign in. English, English, English. English, yay. Take away. Right, we're off. Yeah, here we go, here we go. Right, what's new, Mazzy? The bacon thing. Wow, it's not cheap. Look at the price of these. Dan's going for a what? Double large, grand, extreme, intense cheddar. Okay, so you've got these are new, look, babe. Top fries and bacon cheese deluxe or sour cream fries. Oh, fries, like potato wedges, chip type yeah. things. Oh, you've got. Right, I'll, I'll try this then, bacon for now. Oh, yeah. What's that? Bacon and cheese? Of course, uh. I'm still thinking. Give me a chance. <laughs> Bacon and cheese, top yeah. fries, top fries. Top. Oh, this is like chips, they're like fries. No, they're wedges. They're fries. Mm, I'm going fries. No. You can have beer. <laughs> oh my gosh, you can have get beer. You can and no beer. tax and no tax on your Coke here either. I That's can't believe good. you can get a beer in McDonald's. How do you Right. Happy? Yeah, you pick some up. Um, what's going on then? What happened? How much did we spend? I'll what's the damage? What, we could have gone to a restaurant and got a meal <laughs> for half the price. But yeah. There's things on there we've never heard of. And you won't get them in England, so we're trying them. Yeah. Dan got one of those. Yeah. Oh, I got one of them as well. Dan got one of those, and Dan got one of those. So we got out of McDonald's alive. <laughs> um, yeah, we just ended up, you know, one of the cheap burgers, 99 cents, and uh, some fries to share. Fries to share? What are you on about? Don't tell them how much food we've got, Mazza. Oh God, we've got a, we could feed 5,000. Yeah, but the thing is, <laughs> it, we will eat all of it over yeah, the next will. 24 hours. Yeah. <laughs> and there's things there you just do not get in England. And we haven't had a proper takeaway, to English takeaway since we got here. So. And we still haven't. This is a Spanish uh, McDonald's. Yeah, but we're... So, yeah, yeah, we've got things here which we've never heard of in England, in the UK. And we're looking forward to trying them over the next yeah. 24 hours. Well, we've got to show them when we get home. Can you oh. even remember what we've got? We've got so much. We'll show you. 
and bless Dan, being a gentleman as usual, carrying all the food. Thank you, darling. Yeah, just a pushy 99 pence cheeseburger and some fries to share. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we're just arriving on campsite. Um, this is where we came down for the singing and dancing the other night. Now, that particular video, we did leave, or I left a few clips out on that. Did you? I did. So they didn't understand why we, we turned up at that bar all of a sudden. But we came down there for a few drinks for the singing and dancing. So they don't know about the incident then? No. Is this the point where I say the incident again? Yes. <laughs> so, <laughs> Spanish singer, Spanish dancing. It turned out we were just a Spanish singer singing English songs mainly. Um, and the dancing was just the campsite people having fun, yeah? Yeah. We got in there before he started, believe it or not. And pretty much all of the seats were taken. They were all us. taken inside. Didn't bother us. No. So we went to sit outside. The first table we come to, Mazzy puts her hand on the back of a chair. And as she's doing it, this German group came out, grabbed the other chair from the table. He came grabbed out, grabbed the chair the other out of my hand. They were ripping the chairs out of his hands. Yeah. Yeah, very rude. I have never come across anything as rude in my life. Yeah. Absolutely disgusted with their behaviour. Um, Just so they could get front row seats and bring the chairs indoors, wasn't well, it? I wouldn't matter. There were loads more seats next to yeah. us on other tables. There was loads. They wanted our <laughs> chairs, which we were pretty much sat in. Yeah. So, uh, completely spoiled it for us, didn't it, really? Yeah. And then uh, there's some people, I don't know if you should... No, we didn't show anyone, no, no. Um, people who we met on one of his other campsites, they've booked in here and they were surprised, oh, you're here. <laughs> and we were like, you're here. So <laughs> and it was so lovely to meet had them. Had a drink with them and one, yeah. she gave you a book to yes. read. Yes. Um, Very interesting sounding book. But it was raining at the time, It was the weather was miserable. Put a bit of a dampener on it, but uh, yeah. Anyway, let's get in. And let's get these McDonald's out and show them what Spanish McDonald's is all about, Mazzy. Okay. It's a lot of food. Shall we show them some of the things you just don't get in England, Mazzy? Yes. In the UK. I keep yes. saying England, I'm sorry, to all the other people in the UK. Um, right, firstly, let's go on to the fries. The fries, yes. One of the fries is sour cream flavour fries yay so it's They're like a shake and them. you shake it over i'm guessing yep i'm looking forward to those now you can get it in fry form or in like wedges wedges potato yeah. wedges yeah so that's what mazzy chose yeah what were mine mine was something weird well you've got a meal but it looks like you've got a wedge on top there look. yeah that's a free wedge that's popped in <laughs> hey no eating, we're filming. They're supposed to be a flavour as well. I don't know if it will barb... No. I don't know what it was. No, you asked for barbecue sauce on the side. No, that is something like that. Is it? That's sour cream. That is something, but I don't know what. Oh. It doesn't taste any different. Oh, OK. Um, yeah, we've got sauces. <clears throat> Excuse me. McFlurry. So, you get them in, in England, don't you? But it made out it was something we've never heard of. Well, no, but it was the particular flavour you got. It did say it were new. Yeah, what was the flavour? I don't know. Well, try it. Uh, of course you get McFlurries back home, but you get different flavours. It's ice cream flavour. Ugh. just tastes like a very nice ice cream from your ice cream well, man. Oh, you wouldn't know the difference anyway. <laughs> it's nice, very right, nice. Right, so here we so, go. So these are the big things. So, American-style chicken... Oh yeah, it's meant to have some kind of sauce on that, isn't it? Yes. I forget what the sauce was called. Yeah, I can't remember. You could actually buy the sauce separately in yeah. one of these for 30 cents. But because that had it on, I thought, no, nope, I'll do without. So that's interesting. Yeah. Okay. No Look. no green on it. No lettuce. No, 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 no vegetable at all. Yeah, that's a bit strange. Unusual. <laughs> but there you go. Um, signature collections. What was this one? Mmm. Okay. What on earth's that? 
Oh, yeah. oh, tomato. Oh, tomato. You don't like tomato, but it's looking very anemic, isn't it? It's very thin. And is that the egg? That's the egg, Maz. That's the egg. That's the egg. Can you remember we got egg Benedictine yeah, or something? Yeah, and, and yeah. That's egg. That's egg yolk. And that's the egg. Oh my god, that is ridiculous. Okay. It doesn't look anything well, like the picture. But it might be nice, so don't. It better be. <laughs> Oh, and it's got bacon on it as well. Yeah. Um, oh, Spanishy bacon. It looks all right, though. It does, but that egg yolk is not what I was expecting. Right, that's signature, so bear in mind you're paying extra for the signature collection. Okay. And this is so... like a new McDonald's... What was it, like a extra strong double cheese or something? McExtreme. Grand McExtreme. Oh, it looks like the best one yet. Yeah, it looks like the best. Oh, that's wow. a lot of cheese. There's so, no salad, is no, there? No, don't, don't they do salad in, in Spain? I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. So it's a double burger, big burgers as well. They're thick things. Yeah. Um, it has got bacon under there and a lot of cheese and onion sprinkles. And no green rubbish. Well, do you want to give a last bite then? Quick, a bite. Go on. Only because I have to. How is it? Is that it then? Well, can I start eating No, then? you're not having this. I don't want yours. You're not having any of this. Goodbye. Mm. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. The Big Macs still have green in them yay this is mine looking forward to mine can we see what's in it then is there a gherkin in there yeah two gherkin oh this looks really packed yeah yeah that's a yeah. good big mac that that's a good one you're gutted because you didn't get one aren't you well there is one there what that's mine you got all them this is mine but i love lettuce mazzy i love let where are you going no, don't go in there. Don't go in there. Come and sit with me. We can share. It's Christmas. Just going back to the fries. So we've realised they were mazzies. Yeah. So this, is it a sprinkle thing? Yeah, you can buy sour cream fries and it's just a matter of getting your normal fries and just having to sprinkle it on, which is awkward. Oh, it's very smelly. But how am I meant to shape that? It's very smelly. So You can actually buy them for 25 cents you each can, as well. yeah. Yeah. And what we have noticed is we know that's Mazzy's because this is mine when we opened it. So yeah. this comes with bacon and cheese. Mmm. 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 Mm. I'll tell you what, mine are nice. I'll tell you what, let's try them. You can buy this shaker anyway on a side for 25 cents. Mmm. It's a nice flavour, isn't it? Right, sour cream and onion flavour Pringles. Yeah. It's the mm. same salt. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Right, we're going to yeah. cut this off now. We want to eat. Morning. See you later. <laughs> morning after. Good morning, all. <laughs> right, just to confirm, the best McDonald's meal was oh. the Egg Benedict. I enjoyed the fries, the shaky fries. Yeah. Remember I said that egg looked disgusting. Yeah. It was absolutely beautiful. Yeah. So I'd highly recommend that if you ever come to Spain. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't manage it all, did we? We've got leftovers for tonight. To I think out. I've got one and a half burgers left. Yeah. Um, it looks like it's going to throw it down. <laughs> yes, when it wasn't supposed to though. No. So I've put shorts on today thinking, you know, it's going to be nice and sunny. <laughs> Silly me. We'll be fine. Yeah. So we're just heading to the beach, wandering up there. Mazzy wants to see if this dress shop's open to get the dress she wants. For the which third time. It will not be open. <laughs> Garen No, down here, along the beach, darling. All right. Yeah, beachfront. But it's our last day here today, so I nothing make will the be most open though it. because it's Sunday. Yeah. Well, we never got our last curry, did we? No, we might get that today. Might. Might. We never got to the top floor bar the sky bar that don't open till three by which time we have to be back and edit, and edit. so that's so, a no go yeah 
But um, so there are a few things that we still haven't done. But this has been the best place so far for me. We've had a great time. Yeah. Great time. I'll tell you what, here for Christmas would have been fantastic. Wouldn't it? Oh yes. It would have been. Let's try and cross. This is actually a crossing. Yeah. But they've, re they've resurfaced it so none of the cars are stopping. Thank you. <laughs> they've resurfaced it and they haven't put the zebra crossings back on but you see the sign up there. Cer yeah. Certain people are stopping but a lot of them aren't. I suppose the regulars that know it is actually a crossing. But... Maybe. Yeah. Talking about places to stay for Christmas. Oh, yes. We have now booked in for Christmas. Um, where I booked for my birthday, we've been keeping an eye on it just to see if anything came available for Christmas and it has. Yeah. So we have to leave on Boxing Day. Yeah. But we have a full week there now. We just yeah. have to change pitches on the 23rd of December. Yeah. But yeah, we're there for a week, so we can relax and stop worrying about Christmas. Yeah. But again, Boxing Day wasn't ideal, but I'm grateful, aren't you? Babe? Yeah, yeah. It's gonna be a good week. Yeah. And again, thank you to Sean for the effort you went to um, for the other campsite. That was going to be his backup that, plan. Yeah, we were this close to booking that, wasn't we? Yeah. <laughs> the only person in shorts today in the whole <laughs> of camp here. Everyone's in winter jackets and stuff and wrapped up warm and Mazzy's there in a... It's the first time I actually dragged out my shorts since being in Spain. I haven't worn shorts in Spain. It was supposed to be nice. You just can't tell by this weather. But it's horrendous actually, it's really... Oh my new jumpy! Five euro from the market. Well chuffed. <laughs> right, can we stop talking about clothes now? Oh, go on then, what do you want to talk about? Oh, I'll tell you what we'll talk about. Yeah? Bank blooming holidays. Bank holidays <laughs> in Spain, Jesus. And they're on weird days, aren't they? There's a bank holiday on Tuesday. It's now Sunday. Yes. And that one is called Constitution Day. So all the shops will be shut. And then, if that isn't enough, they're having another one on Thursday. Two yeah. in three days. Um, yeah. Immaculate Conception Day, celebrating the Virgin Mary. Yeah. What's all that about? So that's going to be a bit of a down. And having shops shut when we are in... <laughs> yes! Benidorm! We're off to Benidorm! <laughs> Benidorm is booked. Uh, what did I book? Three nights, was booked it? This morning. You, you struggled three? to book again though, didn't you? Online. Yeah, I'll tell you yeah. what it is. When I'm trying to book online, sometimes my card isn't going through and it's because we're in Spain and the bank isn't recognising. Yeah. They're thinking something yeah. dodgy might be going on. Oh. So then I'm having to go on my bank app and confirm that it's me. Oh, I see. And I think that's what the problem was. Right. Anyway, so we are booked in on a campsite in Benidorm for three nights starting tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> uh, looking forward to it. It's actually a site where the Irish man who we met the other yeah, day. Yeah, we met an Irish fellow. And Pat. It's along here, actually. Somewhere along here, I think. Uh, Ivan and Pat. Yeah, yeah, we just sat on this wall here, I think. Yeah. Uh, they've lived on that site, I think, for seven years, something like that. Yeah, that's amazing. <laughs> so we're going to go there, we'll spend a morning with them one day, hopefully. Yeah, yeah. Um, Change the vlogs up a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, quite excited. So we are going to get to bed in Norm after all. Yeah. And then we are going to have to start rushing around this coast, I, Mazzy. I know, because we've only actually got 17 days to the Christmas one, haven't we? Less, right? I think, yeah. Less. Yeah, and less. It's, it's quite a journey. Mm -hmm. And then we've got to think about heading back up to go home. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I want to go home. We still haven't planned that yet because things can just change like that, can't it? Certainly can. <laughs> yeah. Right. It's raining over there, I think. <laughs> Black sky here. Oh yeah, it's back there. I don't know. I don't know if we're going to get away with this. It's not supposed no. to rain. So it's Sunday. Everything's closed. Our last day here today. But my goal was to come back up and get this particular dress. I know Dan's not interested, but I need this dress in my life. <laughs> okay. It's not to everyone's cup of tea. I get that. 
It's about 90 euros, but 50% off. And I think I'd like that for Tunisia, when we go to Tunisia. They've got lovely stuff in there. There was one dress in there. Like, all the road down there, a couple of them dresses were like three, four hundred quid. Is that enough for clothes today? Will you come back? Just tell me your opinion. And another thing, we actually thought the Christmas market was going to be on in town today, in the old town, or this yeah. weekend, and it's not. It starts tomorrow, yes, Monday on of a all Monday. Days. So gutted about that, absolutely gutted. But, um, so that's kind of throwing our day off really, isn't it? Oh, there's the Punjabi curry Indian house over there. Yeah, look. I think we've decided we are going to get one out. Yes. It opens <laughs> at 12. We absolutely really enjoyed that, didn't we, that day with Gaz? There's yeah. just nothing open, there's nothing to do. We've seen everywhere, we've loved yeah. everywhere. The weather's not good. The restaurants are open, but all the shops themselves, you know, clothes shops, etc., aren't yeah. open. So. Oh, this. We're parked right next to this Yeah. Level. It's only 500, well, 500 I mean, metres sounds a long way, actually, but it's not. Yeah. Do you know, I was thinking that myself when we are only parked right next to it. So what do you want to do, my dear? Grab a beer and wait for that to open, I suppose. What is this actually about, darling? You don't know what this is? No, it's like a... This is famous, Mazza. What, for this what? This is where they filmed Greece. Can you remember the Greece lightning bit? Greece lightning, <laughs> where they were racing side to side, and he, he um. cut into the side of his thing with his <laughs> spooky things. Brilliant film. It all happened right here. Right, so on a serious note, I'm guessing it might be an over overflow to the sea, because the sea's just there, so there's nothing on the other side. Do you think? I've no idea what it is. Let's have a look down. There's no fish in it. Yeah. Back in his lovely spot. The exotic bar is so nice here. We enjoy it's it. It's just the best seat in the world. Yeah, yeah. Today we've got a kite surfer. It's brilliant. Just shooting all. I don't know how this works. They like hover with a little fin, and then you see them sometimes. He hasn't done it yet, but they can like go like 20, 30 foot up in air, can't they? Doing tricks and stuff. But yeah. I'd be terrified that I wouldn't come back down again. I'd just fly <laughs> off. <laughs> Just... Yeah, we, we love it here. We love it here. Yeah, it's really nice. We don't spend all day in the bar, by the way. No, we don't. It just seems like we feel that's. But we are all on holiday, and that's what everyone does on holiday as well. They go to the bars, they go to the restaurants, they go to the shops. But these <laughs> these beers are just so strong. They are. We still ain't used to them yet, are we? Can only have three, and that's me yeah. done. Yeah. Just can't handle them. Yeah. I think I'll be able to pick some John Smiths up in. Uh, Benidorm. Dan's just been showing me on Google to how far we are on the campsite to Iceland. Just around the corner. Yeah. <laughs> and I think that's where they do John Smith's at one pound seventy-five, one euro seventy-five per camp. A lot of money, but let, worth it. Let me just talk quickly about Benidorm. I forget what it's called. Benidorm. Um. That's it, I just figured it out, right? So the lovely couple that we met on the previous campsite and then we bumped into them here, right? So the lovely lady, she's such a character. She's so lovely. Anyway, she told me about this uh, pro TV programme, Bargain Brits Abroad. It's all about Benidorm and stuff. It's, I've been trying to get you to watch it and I'm hooked. I'm literally hooked now. I've never watched it before. Bargain Brits Abroad. It's so good. It's so. It's really is good. It's real life stuff. It's it's like following people, documentary kind of type thing. But it's all in Benidorm. It's not just Benidorm. I've been watching the Moscone Cup pool. USA yeah. against Europe. Europe won last night. Congratulations. Hard luck, America, yet again. <laughs> um, and the World Cup, obviously. It's England tonight. You were watching uh, boxing last night. Boxing last night, yeah. well done, Fury. Yeah. <laughs> Another win. And who was the other fella? DDD or something? Triple D. <laughs> yeah. Derek Akora. Uh, Danny. Akora? Not Derek Akora, he's who lost. Uh, Danny. Uh -huh. Can't remember his last name. Anyway, he won. Anyway, the point is we do our own thing in bed. Yeah. Bargain Brits abroad. <laughs> Moscone Cup.
you can watch all four days highlights it's on YouTube about half an hour each really worth watching you know if you've got two and a half hours to spare although I have just told you that Europe won and it'll spoil it for you so <gasps> don't bother spoiler alert so we're about to go to the Indian for a curry. We are, but we've had to come under shelter for the moment because we're having a, just a quick shower. It's cold. It's cold and wet. And it's raining a little but bit. It's not too bad. It's not too bad. But we've met, we've met a new friend. Yeah. This is Exotic, the waiter. No, she's called Meow. She's called Meow. Meow. <laughs> she's got a name, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of the, it's basically like, you know, like you get the robotic um, lawnmower and, Hoover, and hoovers, yeah. but it's a waiter and they tell it where to go, they put it on the trays, takes it to your table, you can put in the language and it will talk to you in English if you like. Brilliant, brilliant idea yeah i like it i like it yeah i can see it'd work really well if you're in a restaurant which had like oh, hotel. 500 hotel. tables surely it'd be easier just to carry it over uh, uh, in here it's, it's a good it's just a good i like it meow i'd like to sit in action but we're not ordering anymore <laughs> <laughs> Exotic waiter. Yeah, it's brilliant, isn't it? I need one of them in motorhome, Make sure you've got to tip him. He won't know whether you've tipped him or not, will he? Mm, Yorkshireman. And there we go. Right, but how is he now going to pick the glasses off the table to bring them back? Uh, well, that's another question, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> See, that was... If we'd been sitting there, look, we would have been given drinks and all sorts, look. But we wouldn't. I wouldn't have dared... Here he comes. I wouldn't have dared take the things off it in thinking that isn't mine. Hello! <laughs> Come on. Pay attention to your little robot. Right. So we just found out these cost 12,000 euros. Wow. <laughs> That's a lot of meals to get your money back. But just take a look at him. Yeah, he's got his waistcoat on. Her? It's called Meow. No, it's a man. It's a man. Mm. It's called Meow. Okay. What, watch the screen, Mazzy. I'm going to give it a stroke. Oh. 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 It. It's a robot. <laughs> that is so good though, isn't it? Incredible. And there we go, that's the exotic bar that we've been enjoying our holiday in. But we've got a little story to tell, we'll tell you that in a minute. Well, this is interesting. Pharmacy, um, vending machine. Are you going to the bank? Well, I need to. A pharmacy vending machine. What do they sell? Okay, maybe not stuff we need. We definitely don't need none of that. Okay, but it's interesting. Right, so we're off to Punjabi Curry. And then I'll tell you my little story of what's just happened to me. <laughs> right, okay, so we've just been welcomed into the Indian. Oh, what's happened to you? What's happened to you? Oh, you're a bloody mess, aren't you? Well, tell everyone what happened. <laughs> so look at your finger. Oh, my babe. It's bad. It is. It is that. Some people would want stitches for that. In fact, I've got. Oh, I see stitches. something flappy. Don't flap it. Oh. Anyway, first thing to say, we've come back to the Indian. Definitely. We had to, didn't we? Punjab <laughs> curry. Yeah. Best place in the world Recommend. For an Indian. Recommend. Yeah. And we've walked in and he said he saw our vlog. <laughs> that was I didn't even know we told him. No, Gary did. Oh, yeah. yeah. Gary said he told him. That was embarrassing. So the, they've yeah. seen our vlog. Yeah. But we're all good anyway. We yeah. said everything good Absolutely about recommend this. And actually, the old lady we met in the town the other day recommended this place as and well. And the man so. we've just seen in the last yes. place. Yes, he recommended, recommended it as well, yeah. This is a fantastic place. Anyway, let's get back on to me. 
Yeah, can we talk about that quick? Because right. I'm in, gagging. In the last uh, bar. The exotic got bar. Exotic. It's exotic. They've got a snake yeah. behind uh, glass thing. Luckily, I couldn't touch that. But they did also <laughs> have a grey parrot. And I could touch that. And when you go up to it, sometimes it like comes up and it like puts its head there as if it wants you to stroke it. And it just did that. And uh, so I put my finger in just to stroke it. And it turned around and it bit me. A proper bite. And then I went to the toilet, because that's where I was going. And there was blood just dripping in the toilet for ages. <laughs> About five minutes, I couldn't stop it bleeding. So I've had to walk around with a, a tissue. Oh, dear on my Lord finger. God. I just hope I don't catch any rabies or anything i don't know scabies rabies i don't know but well that's a bad bite is that? let's have a proper look no your bite yeah i know but i need <laughs> to throw that in because that's the dramatic look <laughs> oh my god where's the top of your finger gone yeah <laughs> <laughs> have you never been to the zoo when it they was say my own fault. it was my own fault but have you ever oh thank you thank so you much <laughs> Have you ever been to the sea where they say, don't put your fingers in? Don't put your fingers in. I've never been that close to a parrot. Just got bit by a parrot. Oh my God. Yeah, bit by a parrot. <laughs> Egypt. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. All right, as long as you're not going to get ill. No, I think You're going to get septis from that, sepsis. I just don't know what that hanging out bit is. Can you well, see it? Yeah. It's I'm, like a thread hanging off it. Yeah, it's disgusting. People are eating at this time of the day. I'm gonna have exactly the same as I had last time. Me too. <laughs> so we have actually opted to sit indoors today, obviously because it's raining. Um, the one day you don't want the ice cold jugs because it's so cold. But on a hot day, look at Dan's look. Half an inch of ice. You're still looking at that finger of yours, aren't you? Oh. I always hold my finger out like that anyway when I have a drink. Yeah, you do. Yeah. Oh, babe. That actually might make you ill, you know. I wonder if they do a Kima parrot. Kima parrot? I'd love to eat a parrot right now. Papadons, chips, chapatis. And the same curry as I had last time. Oh, the kima, kima. Kima madras. Kima, kima madras. No, but it was kima karai. Karai, karai, <laughs> yes. <laughs> the owner remembers. <laughs> he remembers, but it needed spicing up a little bit, didn't it? So today, I'm wondering if I'm going to get what, what was that curry I just said? A rogan josh. Oh, buna, yeah. Where is that though? I, I know it says like in Spanish and in English, but I do struggle with this menu. A buna, there we go. So I'm gonna get, if that's okay, I'm gonna get a lamb buna, darling. Lamb buna, and where's the rice dishes? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> you need to look at the red writing. The red writing. The red writing. Right, so where's the rice? Where's the rice? Rice, rice, rice. Rice. Is that rice? I don't know. Well, how did we order it, honey? <laughs> Poppadoms, we've got all the pickles. We've got three poppadoms today. We've basically gone for exactly what we had last time. Yeah. And we're trying to remember what we had. Mr. Restaurant or, uh, owner. He knew. He reeled off exactly what I ordered last time and exactly what you ordered last yeah, time. Yeah, he knew. He knows exactly what we want. How he remembers that, I have no idea. No. So I'm getting chips, chapati, kima karai, kima karai uh, normal rice, you're getting... Pila rice. Pila rice. I'm and just getting a sauce. sauce. But this time I'm getting a uh, naan bread, <clears throat> and he, yeah, he knew. He remembered. <laughs> That's no. incredible. I'm looking forward to this, aren't you? Right, leave me alone. Leave me alone. <laughs> oh, I 
desperately need a napkin. But this is too posh to use, isn't it? Do I use this? Shall I use this? Let's put it on my lap. It's a bit posh. Don't want to ruin it. Cheers. <laughs> really looking forward to my main course, but I can't have it until Mazzy finishes her poppadoms. Mm. Let him go nowhere. <laughs> Notice nothing. how we shared it. We did, we did. Mm -hmm. no, a quick look around. It's got a very authentic Indian feel. There is actually one of the guys, I think he might be the chef, who has got the turban on his head as well. But it's got a very ori oriental feel about it. Some lovely pictures. That's my favourite. That's your favourite? No, this one over here. The girl and the man. Oh, this one? Yeah. Each to their own. It's, it's nice, isn't it? It's really nice. You know, the first time we came here, we'd had a couple of drinks and I was thinking it was one of the best curries I've ever had. But am I just thinking like that because I'd had a drink? But today, if the curry is as good as it was, so far, the starter is, the poppadoms are, should I say. Yeah. If it tastes as good, I, I reckon I'm going to have to say this is the best curry place I've no, ever been to. No, it really to. was. It really was. We both agreed on that, didn't we? Well but, done, Gary, for recommending this place. But you've got to remember, Mazzy, I what? come from Bradford. Yeah. Yeah. Now, there's a certain curry. Which is it? Is it the uh, tikka masala? I'm not sure which it is. It's actually invented in England. It's not even an Indian dish. Oh really? Um, but there is a lot of Indians in Bradford and curry places and they are well known for being some of the best curries in the world. And I've been to the poshest one but this to me is so far as good but it all depends on this curry. Where does the kimono, uh, not kimono, but the kima curry come from? Because we don't have that down my way. I've never heard of no, that. No, you do. Ki Not down my way. I don't know the difference. Get a keema naan, but you don't get a keema curry down my way. If you see keema yeah. on a on a menu, uh -huh. a keema naan, for example, they'll probably do a keema curry. Keema just means mince. It's the way mm. they slaughter the animal, I think. Oh. Um, oh. <laughs> I'm not sure. I, I get mixed up. India... Bangladesh and Pakistan make their meats differently, the slaughter the animals differently. But keema oh. is the only mince I've ever found from all them three countries and it is just incredible. Is that a nice way of killing the animal? No. No? No. Oh. A lot of people are again. I, I think they like slit them. I don't know. Oh, I don't know, no, Mazza. No, don't, yeah. I don't know. Don't. But at the end of the day, it's all about the taste. Right. You love this, don't you? This, um, back home, we'd call this a, a Rita or Rita. Yeah, we call it mint sauce. Yeah, but it's <laughs> very thick here. Yeah, look. it's fresh. Yeah. It's like a fresh yogurt in it. Yeah. And in England, that would be frozen for weeks and weeks and weeks and you can tell that's been freshly made it's with a yogurt anyway let's not go on about it let's yeah, just I enjoy wait, i can't wait for my meal and a grub is up there we go we're just Plain missing a, we're missing a rice yeah missing a pillar rice for me so i can't dish up yet but Dan's got plain rice, uh, prata bread, keema, curry, chips. I've never I've heard of prata bread. bread. You keep saying prata bread. Prata? You keep chapati. ordering it. Oh, chapati. Yeah, but you can get prata. I've never heard of prata bread. you never heard of prata? Yeah. So rice like that. 
13 chips. 13. 13. <laughs> yeah, we have, every well, time. We have been picking at those, waiting for the pillow rice. <laughs> there we go. Um, they brought us some special yeah, chilies. chilies from India. Yes. I we did like ask whether we would like those. So I'm going to try that. Uh, Kerry on top. Yep, you're not going to want any, are you? No, no. Because last just... time I left a bit of this so that you and Gary could oh, try some. Oh, no, no. I just got sauce again. No meat. Just, it's just... okay. Oh, no. Gracias, yeah. thank you. Yeah, yes. It's pillow rice. Yeah. Thank you. It's quite funny, actually. Before he came out last time, I says to Mazzy, right, I'm just going to use Google Translate and find out how to say thank you in Indian, right? And I found it, and I said it, and he laughed at me a little bit. He understood? Oh, he understood, but yeah. he saw that's uh, Punjabi or whatever, I don't know. There's different, apparently there's 25 languages in India. Yes. That's incredible. But like the third or the second is English anyway, so... The third language is English. In English, yeah. And on top of that, did you know, there's actually 25 Indians to every one um, <laughs> English person yeah. in the world. There you go. Their population is 25 times bigger than English. That's massive, yeah. isn't it? That's massive. <laughs> 25 more languages <laughs> and 25 times bigger. Right. Right, let's get in. Can we just tuck in? Yeah, well, of course. Let me do a close-up of mine, because it well, looks amazing. Can I do a close-up of mine first? Yeah. There we go. Let's do a close-up on yours. <laughs> Here we go. Look at that. Beautiful. Enjoy, darling. Thanks, babe. You're the best. <laughs> well, that was absolutely delicious once again. Absolutely incredible. We demolished it all, didn't we? Probably the best oh. Indian I've ever had, and I'm from Bradford in England. Oh, oh. <laughs> Don't throw at me today. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Yeah, no, that meal was absolutely... I highly recommend this place, don't we? Absolutely. Honestly, if you're going to Benidorm, Please, Come here. please stop off at Calpe. Have a few days Calpe here. Calpe is amazing. Have a week here if you can. Yeah. And check this place out. We've done a week. Not be disappointed. We've done a week, and to be honest, this would be a great place for me and you for the Christmas. For Christmas, yeah. Yeah. If we'd have known this, we'd probably yeah. next year we might be here for Christmas. Yeah, never know. You just never know. But we're off to Benidorm tomorrow. I'm guessing it's going to be a bit too overpowering for us, a bit too in your face. A bit too in your face, a bit too big. And I think this is a good yeah. balance of... Everything we like. Everything we like. Yeah. So yeah. get yourself to Calpit and definitely come... We've got to thank Gary in. again once again, though, haven't we? Because... And Punjabi. Punjabi yeah. curry <laughs> house. Well, if we weren't for Gary, we wouldn't have come in. No, we wouldn't. <laughs> yeah, right, let's sell the bill. You do get these. You don't get them after eight mint. You get, like, aniseed little... Aniseedy. You don't like them, do you? It, put, it does freshen your breath a little bit, doesn't it? Well, it's something different, in it? If but. I was on the pull, I'd probably have more. <laughs> and this is how your bill comes, in the treasure box. Right, we're off. Even our drinks, once again. Come on. We only got one drink each. We meal. did, yeah. I only drunk half. Once I've eaten, I cannot drink. Let's pay up and go, yeah. Yeah. Once again. Bar Punjabi Curry House. Can't not miss this place. Absolutely beautiful. Right, we're done. Let's get back and edit, shall we, darling? Now, we haven't been paid to do this product review, but we did get oh, the product sent. See you later. The... No, we didn't really. <laughs> There's the owner. See you later. Thank you very much for everything. I was joking, Absolutely. by the way, we paid for everything. <laughs> we did. Absolutely, we did. <laughs> Get yourself there. What a wonderful place. Right. Back to the van. 
Uh, yep. We've got France, Paul and Mazzy at four o'clock. We've got England we've at got... Uh, eight o'clock. No, we've got editing to do that. You've got editing to do. Land tray, land tray. <laughs> so that is it, the end of Calpe. Oh. Got it, absolutely got Maz it. Maz is almost crying. I am. Absolutely my favourite place in the world. In the six weeks that we've been here, whatever it's been. Yeah. We've got Love the it. sun has come out at the yeah. last moment. We've got the beautiful rock back. Um, what a wonderful, wonderful day. Yeah. Hope you appreciate the video. I know there's a lot of food in this one. Yeah. So, you know, I don't know what we're going to call it. You've got uh, Spanish McDonald's options. You've got a curry and Dan's being bitten by a parrot in oh. Spain. So, I don't know what we're going to call it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but uh, we've had a wonderful time here. It's been absolutely amazing. Look, Kelpie, look. Here what a place to end. What a place to end. Love the place. Highly, highly recommend. Say goodbye to everyone, Mazzy, from Calpe. Goodbye, everyone. See you, See you in Benidorm. Benidorm.